Hey guys, World Eater here. We're going to be going over the August 18th, 2022 patch notes. Now we're going to start off with the rewards, right? Of course, with PvP, GVG, Trials, and Fishing. And then we're going to end it off with the shop because there is actually some more new goodies. Just like last week, how they had those uh, pet packs. We're going to have something new this week. Actually, a lot of new things this week. But anyways, let's start off with PvP. Before we go over the PvP rewards, there is actually an additional bonus that came out during this patch notes. Before I forget, I want to tell you guys, it's going to be double drop in PvP. So hopefully that double drop is pretty much all week. If not, hopefully at least land, it lands on um, Thursday. That'd be great. So um, yeah, there's going to be double drop in PvP from what I checked in patch notes. It's going to be a team of three this week. The rewards are going to be regular pumps. Coming with regulators, brain stems, and micron chippos. For the points, it's going to come with regulators and gems. Let's carry it on to GVG. The rewards are going to be mounts. It's going to come with component cream, critter jelly, and mount guts. The points are going to come with the coins, of course, along with gems. Going to trials, the rewards are going to be the meta runes, coming with all three fragment types. Points are going to come with gems and rune fragments. Finish it off with fishing here for the rewards. It's going to be stat points, micron chippos, seashells, and gems. For the points, it's going to be micron chippos, gems, and gold. Now that's it for the rewards. Let's go to the shop. I'm going to give you guys some uh, recommendations. I'm going to go ahead and also show you what's new. I'm not going to go over anything old, so let's check it out. I'm not sure if this is new or not. But these flash shells seem pretty new to me. They seem like they're standing out a little bit more, and I see legendary in the name. Normally, I never see that, so it's pretty cool. I know I saw Mount Guts there earlier, which I never see, so I'm not sure if it's just my RNG, but new. If not, maybe I'm just late to it. Who knows? But um, I know those flash shells have been there, but they look pretty good now. Anyways, go on to the XXL pack. Um, we all know what the XXL pack is, and if you don't, it's pretty much 10 of each. Uh, with a bit gore versus the eight of each with a bit gore for the same price. So XXL pack out this week. Get one while you can. We're gonna have all these new adventure bags, and I'll start off from the bottom with the common adventure bag. Now I'm gonna tell you right now, all these bags are pretty much the same, just scaling up with um, the amount of rewards you're getting. Okay, as you can see here, I'm going through them right. Now the one problem with all of these packs is they have no boosts. I personally think. Um, each one should come with some kind of boost. Even this common adventure bag, I think, should come with an epic scroll. The rare adventure bag should come with, like, um, maybe an item fine tomb, you know? And then the epic one should come with a super scroll. And the legendary one, well, who knows, whatever they want to put in there, but something should be coming in here. I think we should be getting some boosts in these. Hopefully they hear this or they just get some feedback. But I think personally, even if they're small boosts, even if they're just epic scrolls, I think every pack should come with something. But um, they're pretty good if you're just trying to restock on on um, resources. The only one I kind of recommend is probably this one. And even then, I'm still not sure if I recommend it. I'm pretty lost with these. But um, I guess it's up to you on these. They're okay by me. I'm glad they're kind of going in this direction with newer items and expanding the shop. So it's pretty exciting. Let's check out the event pack. I think it's the same. Yeah, event pack's the same. And the super accessories pack. Now, this one is probably the best deal in the shop right now. It's pretty much a mirror image of last week's sale, except it's not pets. It's accessories. So you're going to be getting that defensive and offensive accessory. At least one epic in. So you're going to at least have epics. So pretty much if you're a new player, totally worth. If you're an older player and you really want to get those legendaries so you can scrap and make mythic um accessories it's pretty risky so it's up to you you won't be guaranteed a legendary but you can get from one all the way to even 10 legendaries depending on your luck honestly so hopefully you guys that are getting this pack get those legendaries i wish we could all get one but hey we know it's a chance i recommend going for it but it's up to you we also have some new items over here in the other section now i'm gonna tell you right now the small new player pack, Yuki. I would not get it at all. I, I don't recommend anyone get it. But these two are not bad, and I'll tell you why. So this one comes with stat points, and it comes with all of these little bits of uh, 
consumables for energy types, right? But it comes with a bub gore. And not just a bub gore, it comes with a pet egg and a um, offensive accessory bump. Now this is cool because it's really good for starting the game. This is great for starting the game. If you guys want to start the game and you guys don't know what to buy, I know some people like starting games and uh, checking out things to buy. This is super nice to buy. Only because after hitting, I'd say tier four, maybe even five, um, you start slowing down. Like you won't be able to endlessly play your energy because usually just by playing, you'll level up. And when you level up, your energy bar fills back up. So once you run out of that, you can pop this guy right here and you can honestly probably skip, I'd say maybe up to tier eight, nine, probably at least tier seven doing that strat. So it's a pretty good tier skipper at the beginning of the game. 20 bucks, that's not bad. Um, going on to the large new player pack. I like this one a lot. It's only 10 more dollars and it gives you one of each, which is why I like it. it helps you choose what role you want to do. You can try both out. Um, you also get quite a bit of stuff. You get um, the bub gore and you get all these stack of 50s here, which is great other than, of course. I really wish it came with raid shards, but I can see why they didn't do that. Um, one of these ra one one of the packs of raid shards honestly is like super super good. No, they're not gonna give because it's five hundred percent. I don't find. I accept. But anyways, that's just something else. We can go on with that some other time. This is a very good pack. I recommend buying it. In my opinion, the best things in the shop right now are that accessory pack and this pack right here. I'm not sure if I went over this, but I'm gonna come back over here. Um, there's this large lucky boost box, right? It's 1,000, and it has an Ultra Core. Again, it is a gotcha box, so that's up to you if you guys want to go for it. It's the cheapest I've seen it in a while, and it has an Ultra Core, so if you have maybe like 6K plus gems and you want to go for it, you can, but should you? No, it depends. That's up to you. Yeah, that's going to be it for that. Now, there was one hidden, I guess, sale, technically? Um, that you can get if you click on the bottom left next to your character's picture you will see this little icon the little whatever that is little film kind of icon i don't know what that thing is called <laughs> to be honest but you click on that right and it's going to take you to the permagore and i believe if you have permagore you can check your stats and there's an easter egg there i am not sure if that's true um i found out all this information in uh, some discords hopefully that's true but yeah that's just the only way you can see it is if you have permagore and you go to your settings. That's pretty much going to be it for these patch notes. If you guys have anything that you guys want to share, put them in the comments. Even if it's like a bug that you saw or that was confirmed right after this video came out, go ahead and put them there so people can check it out. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. I'm going to be releasing these every week. You guys are awesome. This is World Leader. Have a great one, guys. Peace.